Dillo, multi-instrumentalist and singer. So we're going to get get right into it with Joe. Let's do it. Because of the way I just introduced you, the first question has to be, how many instru instruments do you play? It's quite a bit. You know, I, I do get asked that question a lot, and I should figure that out. Um, I started in saxophone in third grade, alto sax, and then picked up more saxophones and then flute and clarinet and then pretty much anything with a reed on it. So if you know it, you know anything about instruments like reed instruments, all of those, oboe, bassoon, and then, you know, piano, guitar, bass. So what's your percussion. what's your favorite? It depends what kind of mood I'm in. Um, I would say overall generally it's probably gonna be the tenor saxophone. Okay, so for, for someone like me who's kinda, you know, an idiot when it comes to that. what is to music what is that exactly okay so if you know let's say uh, Bruce Springsteen mm -hmm. of the sax player for them Clarence Clemens yeah okay he's well known for that I mean the saxophone looks tiny um, in front of him right but, yeah. so that's the tenor saxophone right there or Saturday Night Live Lenny Pickett gotcha um, the, the guy who has like those higher squeaker notes and stuff like that that's the tenor sax. All so right. usually in third grade you start off on alto, then some sometimes you stretch to you know tenor or baritone sax. But tenor sax is hitting it right now. Perfect, perfect. Um, so what would careless whispers be? <laughs> uh, that's that's alto saxophone. Okay. Right, and I actually do that at my shows every now and then. Awesome. And I'm throwing saxes. All right. Joe, how did you get your start in music? I um, I actually had. Speaking of alto saxophones, um, my grandfather played the alto sax in the in the army, and when I was I think probably in second grade, I was um, you know it was date night for my parents, and I was get I was uh, at my grandparents' house being babysat, and uh, I was rummaging uh, you know curious little kid and rummaging through like their closets and stuff, and I found an old case and it was the alto saxophone, and I said you know that's cool, uh, play it. And he hadn't played it since the army, and he he was retired, and he started playing it again. And I was like, "That's cool! I want to try it." So, that was yeah, probably around second grade. And then um, they had uh, I had a great uh, elementary school music program, so just kind of went up through there, through high school and college and everything. And yeah, it's been 